let's see this question can you take your copy pen and can you draw the diagram before drawing the diagram let me tell you actually this will always happen this will always happen what they will do with the four hole they are not using the implication with the four hole they are not using the implication this will always happen this is what the gate professors do this is what the gate professors will do they will always do this because what they are doing because what they are doing basically they are doing like this you know that p implies q you can write as p bar or q yes or no you can write this as p bar or q okay so the same thing they will do the same thing they will do that if 4 all x px uh, p implies q this is what they will write in the gate exam they will give you this so this will be given in the gate exam they will give you this this they will give you so what you will do you will translate into this because this is more user friend this is more readable this is more readable this gives you more okay so remember you convert this into this okay so you can notice this is what they will do remember this will always happen they will give you this so that so that you have to convert this into this one more thing for example if you have this time uh, like if you have four rolex and let's assume p or q bar or r or s so what you will write it what you can write it you can write it many different ways you can write it in many different ways you can write it like this this implies r or s agree or not you can write like this this implies r or s agree or not yes or no you can write like this the same thing you can write in another way the same thing what is the another way are the same thing you can write in another another way you can write p implies q bar or r or s the same thing you can write in another way the same thing you can write in another way p bar or r or s so in the gate exam they can give you anything can you see the gate professors they can give you anything you know the dialogue from a wednesday there is a movie a wednesday hum to tumhe aise hi marenge tum batao tum kya kar loge so so the gate professors they are saying that we will give you anything whatever we want now can you solve it can you analyze it yes or no there is a movie a very excellent movie a wednesday have you seen this a wednesday so the excellent performance by nasruddin shah you can you can check it out okay after the gate exam you can watch it. there is a dialogue in this movie ki hum to tumhe aise hi marenge tum batao kya kar lo okay so similarly here in the gate exam they can give you whatever they want to give you okay now can you do the analysis that is your responsibility can you do the analysis for example what is another way of doing this i can also give like this r bar and p implies q bar or s is this correct is this correct tell me is this correct yeah this is also correct right yes or no this is also correct so remember the, all of them are correct like okay they can do whatever they want to do for example they can also give you this r bar and s bar and q implies p bar this is also correct okay this is also correct so they can do whatever they want to do now let's solve this question so first of all you convert into implication okay which makes sense so first of all you convert this so that it becomes more readable so you can notice employee e what it means tell me first of all what it means tell me this means e belongs to employee so this query is is trc1 or trc2 so this is trc1 or trc2 this is trc this is trc1 query this is trc1 query right yes or no very simple so this is the first thing next you next you rewrite this next you rewrite this in the readable format so that it becomes readable format so we can rewrite like this okay for all x i can say that if that then this would happen okay i can say i can say like this see this is this is negative this negative condition you can use as one so you can say like this that if this is employee 
if this is employee if this x is employee and the x supervisor x supervisor is a, is a, is the same as is e, e name in this situation what should happen in this situation what should happen in this situation x must be male in this situation x must be male tell me did you get it yes or no very simple in this situation it must be male that's it this is your question let me tell you this is your question that's it this is the question actually in this question only this is the trick only this is the trick there is no other trick this is a very simple question so in this question what happens so first of all this query is like this i want only names i only want names this e is a free variable or bounded variable this e this is a free variable or bounded variable this is a free variable okay this is a free variable next you can notice e dot names us that e belongs to employee table e belongs to employee table and okay e belongs to employee table and what should happen and this should happen what should happen for all x what should happen this would happen for all x if it is employee and super uh, if it is employee okay if it is employee and this is a uh, so x supervisor is a name means this this is the supervisor okay means this person okay let's assume this person even is there okay so when even okay before that let me write this so you can notice what i'm saying i'm saying that this x belongs to employee table this x belongs to employee table and and you can notice the name of supervisor of you uh, x the name of supervisor of x that is same as that is same as e dot name that is same as e dot name okay if this happens if this happens then this would happen if this happens then then this x must be male then this x must be male okay this is your query now let's see this query what this query is doing we will understand this query very step by step so first of all in this query you notice when you will come when something will come in the output when something will come in the output this even when it will come in the output tell me okay the name let me tell you the name for example some name i am giving you okay let's assume some zone when this zone will come in the output this zone will come in the output okay this zone will come in the output if it is an employee if it is employee so this zone must be employee right so few things this zone must be employee okay the second point what is the second point the second point is for all for all if it is supervisor of anyone yes or no for all if zone is supervisor of anyone then that must be male yes or no if zone supervises anyone if zone is supervisor of anyone see 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 for all for all people for all people if their supervisor is zone for all people if their supervisor is zone then that person must be male for all people if they are okay i can say for all people for all employees what should happen for all employees i can say for all employees x if a supervisor of x is zone if supervisor of x is zone then x is male then x is male yes or no then x is male i can also say that i can also say that if john has if john is supervisor then john will only take male people yes or no if john is supervisor okay if john is supervisor i can also i can also say if john is supervisor then it's a uh, then it's a subordinate must be um, uh, male then it's subordinate okay what is the name subordinate yes then subordinate must be male yes or no correct so i can say the same thing i can say that basically i can say the zone will only supervise uh, males zone only supervise males okay zone only supervise males only guides males that's it so this is your answer so finally 
what will be the answer so i want those people who who don't have any female sub, uh, subordinate i can say yes or no so zone will be in the output remember in the output you will have zone those people who have no female subordinate those people with no female subordinate so answer will be option c did you get it please tell me did you understand this see very simple this is the query we want those people who are in the employee table okay you want those people the name of those people who are in the employee table such that such that if they are supervisor of anyone then that person is male so only guides male or i can say no subordinate is female zone has no female subordinate like this you can do so this is your question tell me did you get it anyone has any doubt in this uh...